Okay, um, chapter five of the Prince. Um, now, Machiavelli was speaking on if territories used to be free, then you can either one destroy it, two you can let them continue living free, but then having friends in position to, you know, help you keep hold of it, or three to let them continue living free while you get taxed from it basically you know you basically you know just get paid from it now um Machiavelli basically was saying that the the best way is if people used to being free to just destroy it um because if you don't destroy it you will be destroyed by it so just hypothetically speaking in America, we used to doing what the fuck we want to do. So if somebody tried to come over here and subdue us to foreign rules, you know, they best bet would just be to, you know, um, harm people, divide, you know, destroy shit. Um, they'll just have to basically do some treacherous shit because we are always remember what democracy felt like. So it would be hard for people to accept it. Um, and um, by the same token, he was like, if people used to a, a figure like, say for example, a king or a queen, um, if that king or queen is, is, is driven out or whatever, and um, there's no one there to take their place, then those people will be scatterbrained because they are already accustomed to being under control. So, in a nutshell, people, this is, I'm, I'm just speaking theoretically, like in general, what I get from that is people who are used to being controlled are easier to control. People who are not used to being controlled, they're going to be a problem. And so, if people used to being free, it would be better if you... um basically broke that shit up. You'll have to break up their freedom, you know, destroy and rebuild. But um, if you have a group of people and they used to being controlled, it'll be easy to control them because they are already accustomed to it. So, you know, that's what I got from this shit.